Hi there, this is Chris from Zoometrics. Today, I'd like to talk about using Tableau to analyze Google Search Console data. First of all, what is Google Search Console? Google Search Console used to be called Google Webmaster Tools, and Google Search Console is a free service offered by Google that helps you monitor and maintain your site's presence in Google Search results. You don't have to sign up for Search Console for your site to be included in Google Search results, but doing so can help you understand how Google views your site and optimizes performance in search results. You want to use Search Console because you want to monitor your site's performance in Google Search results, not only because you want to make sure that Google can access your content, you want to be able to submit new content for crawling and remove content you don't want to show in search results. And it's important to create and monitor content that delivers good SEO practices and performance. You also want to monitor and reserve, you know, resolve malware or spam issues so your site stays clean. Uh, it's also important because it provides you some data. You know, which queries cause your site to appear in search results? Do some queries result in more traffic to your site than others? Or which sites are linked to your website? And is your mobile site performing well for visitors searching on mobile or not, or desktop versus tablet? So there's a lot of good benefits for you to be on Google Search Console if you run a website. Uh, in this um, video, what I'll go, what I'll do is um, go through the steps um, I use to analyze Google Search Console data with Tableau. The key things I want to go through is, you know, uh, use Google Sheets. You know, it's a free tool again from Google. And I added a search analytics for Sheets plugin. Uh, it's an add-on that you can actually install. And it allows you to automatically bring in Google, Google Search Console's data automatically into your worksheets. And once you do that, uh, you, you can use Tableau to connect to Google Sheets and use Union um, to create data source with a combined data from different worksheets or tabs. And I'll show you that. And within, when you create the union, um, you use a wildcard to reference the, uh, the right sheets to combine. So it's kind of like a rule to say, you know, hey, based off this equation, pick these sheets and combine it. And finally, we created a few Tableau reports to analyze SEO performance. Okay, let's go through that. Now here's the Google um, Sheets that I was talking about. Now if you go to add-on, um, what I did was I added the search analytics for Sheets. And when you open up the sidebar, uh, what I've done is I selected backup and I put my site and put all the criteria in group by, like the data, query, page, country, device and pretty much select it to run every month. And what happens is it's gonna put my December, January's data. And as you can see here that, you know, every month is gonna create a new worksheet to represent that month data, okay? So, so once you do that, you come into Tableau, you pop it open, and you create a new data source with Union. And like I said, within this feature, in, the new, in this particular new version, you can actually select wildcard and say, hey, worksheets that contains anything with two zero in it, with any characters prior you know, to the two zero and any characters after two zero, you know, combine those data. And then what it does is it brings in my December or January's data here in one view. Now, once you're able to do that, that is your data source for creating a report within Tableau. And then you could start doing cool things like creating charts like, um, you know, month of a month, your impressions, average position, clicks, and click through rate. And you could, you know, obviously use Tableau to kind of break out the platform data because that's certainly provided. And when you ingest the Google Search Console data, and you could immediately see that, you know, average position is not so well for my site, but you know, it has room to improve. Um, and you can certainly see the impression is wildly different across desktop versus mobile. And click through rate is certainly better for mobile. So there's some opportunities to improve the SEO here. Now, another cool report that I like is, you know, creating positioning reporting. There's a feature in Tableau where you can actually create uh, what we call a bin. So if you have an average position data, you create a bin and then what it does is 
what I'm doing here is bucketing the position from like 0 to 10, 10 to 20, 20 to 30, because on the first page of Google search results, it's showing 10 pages or, you know, it's basically going to show 10 sites there. So as a, from the SEO perspective, you well, we want to rank on the first page of Google search results when you search something. And from the SEO perspective, you have potential to move the keywords and the pages or, you know, your site and your pages from the, the top 10 to 20 to the first page. So those are going to be the key area. What's interesting is when you look at this data, it's not surprising to see a lot of impressions in the first page, right? That's ranked at zero to 10 and you get a lot of traffic from that and then the click through is great and that's going to deteriorate and you're going to find occasionally some interesting things where that impression comes back up but you get zero clicks hmm that's strange maybe it's a bot i don't know but you could see that desktop versus mobile has different performance right and the other cool thing that i like to look at is the list of keywords that people are searching and by creating that bin and leveraging that data I'm looking at the 0 to 10 bin and 10 to 20 and 20 to 30. And when I create a heat map based off number of impressions, I can actually look at which keyword is actually seen the most within, you know, which group of, uh, I guess, the, uh, the, the page within the search results. So for these keywords, I get a lot of eyeballs, the impressions on the first page of Google search results. And you can see that the heat map there. And for that keyword, some of my content is showing up in the second page, in the third page, etc. And this gives you an opportunity to look at, you know, certain keywords that can actually do better, or potential opportunities where I can move these, improve the content, and maybe potentially move these um, keywords and content to rank higher and to the first page. And conversely, I could also look at the mobile versus desktop. Desktop, so. You know, there's maybe some opportunities that's unique to mobile, and maybe I could put more SEO efforts around that to optimize the contents to be more relevant for that particular keyword. Okay, so hopefully that was in, um, helpful for you. Uh, it's a really basic way to um, automatically ingest Google Search Console data into Google Spreadsheet and use that data to pull into Tableau and analyze the data. It's really fun, guys. If you guys really like what you saw, please go to, go to my website, zoometrics.com and subscribe to receive a freaking update from me. All right. Thank you, guys.